Uh, what is your name and what company do you work for? My name is Michael Coderick. I work for St. Paul Yellow Taxi. How long have you been a taxi driver? Uh, as a driver, probably 15 years, but I've been in the industry for 28 years. One Friday night, I went out and drove cab, and I'll tell you what, it was the greatest thing ever. Why do people choose taxis over buses? Well, because a taxi will offer door-to-door -door service and timing. You know, buses do take time and trains do take time to get people around where taxis on not. My average time that I have a fare in the car is about 18 minutes, and that gives them door-to-door -door service so they can get to where they need to be quickly. Have you ever been held up or had a situation where it involves somebody threatening you? Yes, I had a young man pull a knife on me about 20 years ago, and he did it, he did it on the freeway. And through uh, talking with him, I had him throw the knife out, or otherwise I was going to make sure the last thing I did was roll the car on him. So it would have been an interesting deal. So what's the farthest place you've dro driven to? Uh, Mexico, Missouri. And he offered me $600 to drive him down there, so I did. <laughs> How do you predict your, your job as a taxi driver will change because of the light rail? No, I don't think it's going to affect it that much uh, because people don't want to carry luggage and groceries, etc. on the light rail. How do you think the light rail will change University Avenue? I, I, I don't know that it's going to change it that much. How have you seen Uni University Avenue change over the years? Well, University Avenue I don't think has changed that much until the light rail construction and now newer businesses are coming up and older businesses, smaller businesses have lost their you know, gone away. What is the easiest part about being a taxi driver? The easiest part about being a taxi driver probably would be dealing with people. You know, you can pretty much take a person in a bad mood, put them in a good mood. It's your attitude. Driving a cab is all about attitude. You come out here with a bad attitude, you're going to have a bad day. You come out here with a good attitude, you'd be surprised at the end of the day what you can do. Thanks for the interview. You bet, man. Good luck to you.